Hello and welcome to this video about DS918 and how to upgrade it to 16 gig. So as you can see on Synology website, they only say that it supports 8 gig. However, the CPU that's in there, the Celeron CPU, supports 8 gig per channel. So which means that you can, because it has two channels, DIMM A and B, you can upgrade it to 16 gig. So this is the memory that I got. It's from Crucial. Hopefully you can see it sharp. I'll put the link in the description video. So it's 8 gig DDR3L, which stands for low voltage. So you need uh, 1.35 volts. Otherwise it probably won't work. Before we begin, we need to remove the drives. Do remember the order, one, two, three, four. Otherwise your RAID might not start up. and flip it towards the back. And there's several screws. These eight are for those big fans. Um, this one is for the back plate. And all we need to remove is those two. Great. Synology has changed the design dramatically from 916 and this one is really, really easy to upgrade. So all you need now, um, this side, this bigger side comes apart towards the front. So all we need is to move it like this and then just release it. Easy as. And as you can see here below, you've got the two memory slots. So all we need, I'll show you the first one. So all we need is to put it in against the notch. So you've got the first notch and it's here. So this one goes the other way, slide it in and then click. That's it. Now I'm going to change the other one. This is the four gig they used. DDR3L. It doesn't say who is it made by. SK Hynix. Um, I believe that's the Korean company, Hinex. Awesome. Perfect. So now just to slide it back in. Great, let's put those guys back in. Same order as you take them out. Perfect, and you're done. Let's check if it works. Okay, and we are back. System has boot up, and as you can see, this is the home page. I still call it because I restored it just recently, um, 916, so don't mind it. I log in, go to control panel, info center, and you can see it's uh, the model name is, as I said, 918 plus, and the memory is 16 gig. Perfect. So the system 
I have to tell you, it's much more responsive, much faster. Uh, the ButterFS really, really gains a lot from it because also if you have two channels populated, you gain speed as opposed to having just one channel. So um, that's real advantage, even if you have um, eight gig or two twos, it'll still give you more speed than one single four. Great, hope you enjoyed it, liked it. Thank you very much and see you next time.